listening space is going to be the infusion room. Uh, we're coming from a 28 bed unit and we're going to be going up to a 48 bed unit. Each bay has four chairs, so each nurse is going up from a three patient load up to a four patient load. We have the, um, the Hemoc Adult Infusion Clinic here. Um, we will have the um, Clinical Trials Infusion Clinic next door, and then we'll also have the Bone Marrow Outpatient in clinic, Infusion Clinic there. The pharmacy is just going to be down this end, and each of our bay areas um, is easily accessible to it. We love the idea of pharmacy being up here on our floor. I'm sure the pharmacy is going to love that too. <laughs> they don't have to run the stairs anymore, neither do we. We actually have a full med room that we can go in and get all our meds ready and, and get them prepped in there instead of out here at the chair side. We will be also using new uh, med carts. Uh, each of us will be assigned our own med cart and, and laptop computer. So that cuts down on everybody um, buying for a computer to work at, which will make life a lot easier for us. The space is organized very well. As you can see, the counter I'm sitting on has room. This space will be for patients to put their own things, rather than um, us having to store our equipment there, because in the past we haven't had as much space for that. There are computer outlets here, so that they can <laughs> use um, a laptop and have the internet if they'd like to. Um, we also have new flat screen TVs which will help, you know, if somebody's here for a really long treatment, it will help cut down on their boredom. Um, and the pillow um, speakers will make it easy for them to hear the TV without the environment becoming too noisy or congested. Patients like being with other patients at times. They find it to be a support group in a way. And they still have that here. It's open. They can see other patients and choose to talk if they want to. But they also have more of a semi-private feel where if they need alone time just to rest or process what they're going through, they don't have to be close to somebody else at that time. And there's plenty of room for visitors to be with them. We're in absolute awe over the size of this space. It's beautiful. It's uh, open. We have windows to look out of now, and so do the patients. The colors, I mean, even the leaves and the glass are just so pretty and detailed, and when you look out of the windows, you can see for miles over the Chapel Hill horizon, and I can't wait to be in here when it's, when a thunderstorm is rolling in, or when it's snowing, and just, you can take a deep breath. I think it's healing, and I think it's an enjoyable place to be, even though patients who come here will be going through a difficult time in their lives. So hopefully it'll make it a little bit better. The overall feel, the mixtures of textures, is the design staff has done their job well. It's very, very relaxing. I, I just look at it and go, oh, 